As you can see on the table here, I got some panels already set up. This panel here is one I've already painted and clear coated. This is the rear panel where the license plate goes on. These are side covers I've already done a rosebud on. Now what I'm going to videotape for you is this front fairing. I'm going to do probably, I don't know, maybe one, maybe three roses. I'm not really sure until I start doing it. I'll lay it all out and I'm going to show you guys the process as we start going. Now as you can see in the background, I have three companies on the wall. These are three company, uh, companies that I use all the time. Coast Airbrush, I love them. They have every product you possibly want for airbrushing and painting. House Color, great brand of paint. That's what I'm going to use on this. And what can I say about Iwata? I, I use only Iwata. As you can see, i got an Iwata on my arm. Um, they're great airbrushes. They're workhorses. They're durable. And you guys will never have to buy another airbrush again. But again, all three of these companies I highly recommend. Hi, I'm Claire Anchers. I'm here today with Ed Hub of Full Blown Customs. And Ed and Full Blown Customs is bringing my dream alive. This bike, better known to me as Rose, uh, has been a long time in making. The Rose was not only my grandmother's name, but also one of my favorite flowers. And as some of you may be aware, the pink rose symbolizes breast cancer, um, and many cancers for that matter. Most recently, as a matter of fact, approximately eight weeks ago, I was diagnosed with a very rare cancer called adenocarcinoma of the appendix. Why the appendix? Nobody knows. As a matter of fact, only 2% of us actually live to see the diagnoses. Most people are die, have died before they actually arrive to the diagnoses. So I find myself very fortunate to know this ahead of time. It's given me the opportunity to live my dreams. Along with my dreams is the hope to enjoy as much of life as I possibly can. And that's what I'm doing. Every moment is precious. Every day is precious and we never know what tomorrow will bring. I enjoy all of my yesterdays. I look forward to my tomorrows. And life is just filled with ventures. That's what life really this is. This is a photograph, laid it down, took a uh, piece of carbon paper, laid it on this. This, is, this white paper here is transfer paper. You can buy all this from Coast Airbrush. Laid that down. Drew it out, and what you just seen me doing there was a razor blade, and that was the last cut I did. I've cut this whole design out. From that point, I'm going to use my house color, and I'm going to use my Iwata airbrushes. We're going to go back in, I'm going to pull each layer out, and I'm going to start doing each layer. Now I'm going to show you another technique. You can see I've already sprayed through this before, but you get a dryer sheet. Make sure that you put it through the dryer, um, because if you just use it uh, straight, like this one is here, you'll see that it's... Um, really tight, but I've already pulled this one apart. I'll spray up here so you can see a little bit. See the design it gets? So now we'll spray through it. Doesn't take very much. About like that. So when we put our candy on it, that'll really stand out. So we're going to do the same thing to everything all the way across here, then I'll do the candy.